Welcome to the 2009 Washington Auto Stroll, where the theme is driven by an environment. And we're having a perfect example of that. So we're going to talk to the CEO of Fisker, Henrik Fisker. Tell us about um, how you manifested this car and where you want to go with it. Well, the, the whole technology actually came from a development in the U.S. military for a secret uh, vehicle that they were using to drop behind enemy lines. So we basically took that concept of this drivetrain and make a civilian drivetrain out of it and use a gasoline engine, but then a very large lithium-ion battery. So this car is sexy, good-looking, and it's got 400 horsepower like a V8, but you'll still get over 100 miles per gallon on average over a year's use. What are the challenges of making sure that it could fit on a sports car platform? This is like a first to us. Well, the, the interesting thing about a plug-in hybrid vehicle is we need a smaller battery because you still have a gasoline engine that turns on after the 50 miles. And it actually fits between the seats, in, running sort of in the center console down through. But it actually is really good for the, for the uh, center of gravity, so the car almost handles like a sports car. Being that you're coming out with you know, the first sports car hybrid, so to speak, how do you market that type of vehicle and still educate the consumers without losing their interest? We actually seen the consumers getting excited about this vehicle. You know, they love the huge. This, we've got the biggest solar roof in the world on this vehicle. I think what the consumers uh, are, are demanding and asking for is cool, you know, environmental vehicles, and this is the first one. 